Halloween is less than a month away, and the Polynesian Cultural Center is celebrating the event with the Haunted Lagoon Canoe Ride. But a warning, it's a spooky ride. And this year, the Laie Lady is back, and only the brave will make it past her. Seth Casey is very brave from PCC, and he's here to tell us more. And that's the Laie Lady. Oh, my goodness. Good morning, Seth. Thanks morning. for joining us. Thank you for having me. So we're scared right now, but this is uh, pretty scary for all for everyone who's going to be going on this, right? It is. It is. <laughs> it's going to be a blast. We want everyone to come out. What can people expect? Well, a lot of scares coming from above you, around you, on top of you, every which way from the lagoon. Um, it's it's just a great time. Seth, we just saw um, La Ye Lady uh, <laughs> just crawl by. Yep. Tell us a little bit more about her, what the history behind that. Yeah, she's she's everybody's favorite character in, in our, our story. And she's basically, um, we don't know why she's this way, but she's, uh, she's a vengeful spirit. She's searching for her lost son, um, who's also in the lagoon. And um, she makes several appearances uh, in the Haunted Lagoon. Wow. And people think they've really seen her in real life, right, Seth? Mm -hmm. uh, no comment. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it's the mystery of it's the It's the mystery. Oh, boy. Now, I'm sure there are a lot of people who are going to be coming uh, to this event uh, this weekend and actually during the next month. How do people avoid the lines out there? The, the best thing to do is to go to our website, hauntedlagoon.com. Um, and you'll be able to see beforehand if the day is sold out or what day, so you can plan ahead. Um, and then you're able to book your tickets early and you can avoid some of that line. And the best thing about these kind of rides is that sometimes things just kind of like pop out of, out of nowhere, right? Oh yeah, you just never know when stuff are gonna. <laughs> <laughs> like now? <laughs> these are your ghouls and goblins here and your yes, clowns? Yes, they're, they're actually clowns. part of a, They're actually part of a new section from that we, we added just for this year, so. <laughs> And uh, how many people do you expect to perform in there? It, performing, we have over 150 people mm -hmm. actually performing in it. So it's a very large production. We're actually the largest haunted attraction in Hawaii. Um, <laughs> so it's, it's a lot of fun. And this is the third year that you're doing this? This is the third year, yeah. And we, we have Kiki rides for those who are afraid that maybe it's a little too scary for the uh -huh. kids. We've got a toned down version for the Kiki, but um, <laughs> If you want the, the scares, it's Attack better. Kenny. <laughs> I didn't know clowns woke up this early. Yeah, the they don't. Well, obviously, they didn't put their makeup or on scary Kenny clowns, or Mr. I T. Say. All right, Seth Casey, thank you so much thank for you. joining thank us. Thank you so much. I'm sure it's going to be a great, great event. Coming up next, uh, KITV4 Social Wires featuring our app of the week. And these apps are for kids. Actually, the apps are for parents who need an electronic babysitter for their kids. We'll be right back. <laughs> Ooh, scary. It is uh, 619. Ah! <laughs> oh boy.